Ooh, baby, baby, baby. Maple cookies. What are you doing? Where'd you get those? Uh, tar Target, three sixty nine. dollars What? Did you forget Dollar Tree for $1.25 has the most awesome maple cookies? I forgot. I forgot. Filling his cookies, let me tell you. Well, you know what we need to do? Go to the Dollar Tree? We do. Yay! <laughs> so what do you say? All right. I don't need much uh, convincing to go to my favorite place, my happy place, Dollar Tree. I hope you're all ready for a Dollar Tree trip also. And hey, everybody, it's Shelby with a Chick Plus 3 and Cookie Monster. Maple Bill. <laughs> so I hope you're up for a Dollar Tree shop with me because that's where we're headed now. So... Yes, Bill, what do you say? Let's go. Let's go. All right. These are pretty darn good. Very good. All right, now that we're all hepped up on sugary cookies, let's do a little Dollar Tree shopping. Santa Claus is coming to town. Look at this countdown to Christmas calendars at the Dollar Tree for $1.25. There's the man in the big red suit or his sidekick partner in crime, Rudolph. And look at these giant tag signs. These are beautiful. Ooh, it said, be merry. Here's one that says, peace. It's in black with a little bit of greenery and a nice ribbon on it. Ooh, and look at this one, joy with the red and white. Very nice. Oh, and what have you found there, Bill? Oh, a little wreath. So it's not the thickest wreath, but you could certainly spruce it up with some Dollar Tree bulbs or garland. It does have a bell. What's that? Things are up so high. Thank goodness I have Bill with me. Ooh, it says faith. And that's like a raised metal lettering. Interesting shape with a twine hanger. Ooh, and I think I really like this Thank evergreen you. colored one that says hope. Again, with the writing in like a raised silver metal. Now, this is fun. This would really go nicely with a gingerbread theme. Look at the little gingerbread man in the back of the truck. Candy cane lane this way. Or if you want to take a trip to Santa's workshop, this sign will point you in the right direction. Oh, and there's even a snowman riding in the back. How fun. And this Santa looks like he just left the workshop. His sleigh is all loaded up with toys. How fun are these signs? So many choices. I am loving it. How many of you remember sticking sequins with pins into styrofoam balls to make ornaments when you were a kid? These so remind me of those. But look at all these nice little collections of ornaments. And here's some star tree toppers. I would be so sad if the Dollar Tree stopped bringing out their annual collection of tins. This year is definitely not disappointing. Look at these fun colors and designs. So many choices. The patterns carry right around the sides and these are great for Christmas or even just for straight up winter. They have a lot of really nice choices. And of course Christmas gnomes. Another Dollar Tree must-have item for both Bill and I are these Snugadoo socks. These are the perfect addition to give somebody on Christmas Eve. How nice to spend Christmas Eve and then Christmas Day in a 
fuzzy, warm, brand new pair of socks. Like but so many socks. And look at these. These are just for like everyday wearing these crew socks. I've always loved socks as a gift. All right, now here's something different. These are little garlands. They're like wired garlands of pine cones, and they're in both gold and silver and white. This is an exciting item. They're by Juncture. They're knit women's headbands. Boy, do you think I could get away with pulling the tag off and saying, why, yes, I knit it myself because they really look spectacular and thick and warm. And the selection of socks Dollar Tree has seems to go on for miles. Something for everybody. In fact, Bill has found a couple of prints that he thinks are catching his eye. Men's size 6 to 12. The further we get into the store, the more spectacular the new finds are. The nutcrackers, do you see this? That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Looks like three colors. Yeah. Ooh, and more gorgeous taper hairs down here. Look at these candles. Oh, I really like them. I like and the they're in the red these. and the white and the green. Ten inches. And what are these? Ooh, ooh, I these really like really these nice. spindle ones. And they have the flat top. Very colonial looking. This is the type of candle that I grew up with. Same thing, red, green, and white. Those are beautiful. And this is a little three pack of tea lights, but they're snowflakes. They're so sparkly looking. That's wow. Different. Speaking of tea lights, how sweet would the tea light look set in this sled? One? Sled, sleigh, I'm not sure, but whatever you call it, it's adorable. It's made out of metal, silver, gold, and then, wow, Bill just pulled out this enamel red with the green holly. Okay, this one looks high end. Ooh, and here are some star tea light holders in silver, white, or gold, sure and then red with truck it. with a tree, of course a little gingerbread house, we have Santa Claus, even a gnome mm -hmm. hiding back there. Now this snowflake collection is just perfect for winter. So if you don't observe Christmas or you just want winter decor, the Dollar Tree has this beautiful snowflake collection. The embossed chargers, the oven mitts, pot holder sets, even glassware. Look at the snowflakes on the glasses. They have these like tall, what are these, like a Tom Collins glass? Really high end looking. And they even, of course, have the hand towel. Now this one is a little microfibery though, so just be forewarned about that. And if snowflakes aren't your thing, look at this holly and berry set. This is a beautiful collection. They have the dinner plates and then they have some luncheon plates or salad plates with the text in them. But I really think I like the straight up plain plate. But this bowl is cute with the little message hidden in the bottom and this super shiny enamel red charger pairs perfectly with this collection. Again, the holly and the berry on these glasses is just beautiful. And of course, the charger also comes in this beautiful silver and they have 
again, the placemats, the pairs of pot holders, and the oven mitt to match, and the towel. And this one doesn't feel as microfibery. That's classy. A little Prosecco on that. I agree, Bill. These glasses are so elegant. I really like the shape of them. What's this one? Oh, Christmas cheer. These are nice. So fun. I love all the new items out at Dollar Tree. <laughs> These are like kind of little tall shot glasses. And then look at this gorgeous candle. Wow. I think you could use those, I bet, as floating candles. They're snowflakes. Look at this one with the gold, but they're packaged all ready for gift giving. And yet, Bill pulled out one in silver. Silver and gold. Oh, more little glasses. Jingle juice. They're kind of fun. Ho, ho, ho. Those would make nice little stocking stuffers. Wow. Oh, my goodness. This is very modern looking, but very like high end, like something you would have found at Crate and Barrel. These reindeer and tree tea light and candle holders. Floating point set of candles, maybe, or you could just put them in a candlestick. And even more glasses. These have little gnomes on them. All different little sayings. Oh, forget elf. Forget the elf. I want wine on the shelf. Oh, man. And some sweater knit style pillar candles. These votive holders are gorgeous. You could use a real candle or I bet even a battery powered uh, like votive and the reflection power I'm sure is incredible because they have like this mirrory glaze on them. So, so pretty. And what is this LED faux flower by Luminescence? Huh, it runs on a battery. This one doesn't have the little pull tab in it. I wonder if people have tried it. It's not lighting up. Oh, and the felted trees back on the stick. Ooh, and look at the reindeer. Now, these aren't glass. They're like a plastic, but they have that nice acrylic feel. Nice and heavy duty. And again, the lights would reflect so pretty off of those. Making spirits bright. Those are more votive holders and then some leaf holders. We've seen these in the past, but they still are very pretty. Rug. Ooh, and look at this rug. Home for the holidays. I love that plaid. Well, look at here. Here's the whole like set of this plaid. This Christmas plaid, it's so pretty. It has a lot of white in it, which is nice. And then true Christmas red and green. That charger is really different. I bet you could do a lot of nice crafting with that. And this is a tumbler. It's really nice. It feels very heavy, like heavy plastic. Now, of course, it says that um, it's not dishwasher safe. But the one thing, guys, it doesn't say on it if it is BPA free, sadly. I wish it said it was BPA free because it's really adorable. And look at all the different designs. Oh, this is a pretty tray. How nice would that look with just a couple of candles or votives, a little bit of pine greens. And here's the whole stack of rugs. And the towels too. Oh, the oven mitts, the pot holders. And look at this placemat. All right, that is beautiful. 
Now you do just sadly get one for the dollar twenty-five. I do wish these were sold in pairs. Now they do have that attached back, so you could slit it open and use it as a pillow cover. So then for a buck twenty-five, that's a deal. Now I think the Dollar Tree has carried these Christmas chair pads since they opened their doors, but I still am so happy to see them return year after year. They're fun and they're not bad quality to tell you the truth. Now what feels really nice is these cotton towels here. They're like the flower sack kind, not the microfiber so they don't give you any of the heebie-jeebies. Well I hope you guys enjoyed shopping with Bill and I today at the Dollar Tree. We will be back again tomorrow with more I was gonna say Dollar Tree fun but I think since it's a Saturday we're gonna hit up a couple of new stores and we'll take you guys along with us so we hope you'll come back and join us but remember our friends until then as always please be well